It was a Friday night. I was hanging out for family movie with my husband and son. Then I got a phone call that the beacon had gone off um, at the campsite. So I paced the kitchen for a while until I got another call from the father who was with my daughter to say that um, she'd caught a fire. It was clear that she had quite serious burn injuries to her face, her neck, part of her chest. A helicopter came and picked us up and it took like a 20 minute helicopter ride to get to the Royal Children's Hospital. We just drove probably about nine o'clock at night to the hospital and straight to the ER. Due to the fire, I burnt 11% of my body, including my face, neck, wrist, most of this arm, my upper arm, and my thigh. A big area of my work is burns and burns care, and when I was on call in January is when I met Holly. While I was in hospital, I had probably around 30 procedures under general anaesthetic. We mostly did skin grafts to cover the areas of skin which were burnt away. Because her burns were quite deep, they were full thickness, she required grafting to all of those areas, her hands, uh, to her face and her neck. And we also did a reconstruction of my arm. At the Royal Children's, it's super important to be at the cutting edge of um, medical technology, especially in situations like this. What the hospital has done is created a 3D mask for her to brush the skin, skin back in place to, as for her healing. You know, we're getting the, the face moulds faster from 3D printing and ultimately, hopefully, they're more comfortable for the patients and f have a better fit. My specialist at the hospital is Monique. She was my surgeon. She's also helped in recovery and she's helped make me feel comfortable at the hospital. Monique likes that we could always express our concerns and questions to her. I think the Royal Children's Hospital is incredibly important to like most children and like especially children like me who have serious injuries or illnesses because they help like save your life. We really rely on the generosity of the public to provide um, these services and, and also for research purposes. It's really important to give to the hospital because they are doing such amazing things with the children there. It's an exemplar as, as far as, as medicine goes. The, the staff, the, the specialists, the whole team are phenomenal and I'm so thankful for everything that they've done for our family. If it wasn't for the hospital, you know, Holly Monday would be with us now. This Christmas, it would be really great if people could donate to the Children's Hospital to help fund all the materials they use to help save people.